ready to go. What's um, your biggest expectation or hope coming into this season? Uh, I mean, I feel the whole season hinges on uh, making the playoffs and uh, winning, winning some games, trying to win a series. That's uh, you got to make steps forward, and uh, that's our next step. What did the team learn from the experience last year? Uh, we definitely learned uh, from the playoff experiences that you really got to pay attention in detail, uh, the physicality of, of the playoffs, and uh, how you know you just gotta you gotta have an extra notch in your game to take it up. Can you just talk about how you know you kind of get this last year, but you're giving credit for this year? The type of being on now and bombing into there. You know, what's your expected out of Tim this year? What's your expected out of yourself this year? Uh, you know, you know me. Uh, I mean, coach kind of kind of knows me better. I'm just gonna go out there and uh, play hard every night. Uh, he knows that uh, I'm more of an offensive player, but uh, I can play solid on defense. So uh, we know we're gonna do it by committee. Uh, all of us bring different aspects. I'm more of offensive. Uh, Ghana's more defense, and Kwame's a mixture of both. So uh, we're gonna go out there and play hard and do it by committee. His his uh this his leadership his uh this as far as the teammates he's irrepla irreplaceable. I mean, he's a great teammate. Uh, you're never gonna find a guy, especially in the point guard position, that comes every night ready to play. Always gives you his all. I mean, plays hurt. I've seen the guy go down. And I'm looking like, oh, there's no way he's playing tomorrow. Ankle swollen, stitches, and he, here he comes. So uh, we're gonna definitely miss that. But you know, it's a business, and uh, you know. The business had to be taken care of, and uh, but I'm as confident in BJ and Sean as as I was in his skills, so uh, we'll be all right. Do you feel like you were having maybe one of your better career seasons last year before your injury? Because you were really uh -huh. in good rut. Oh, I feel like uh, I mean, I feel like just throughout my career, whenever I really got a solid opportunity to play, that I've always uh, played pretty well, and coach was giving me a great opportunity last year to really go out there and play free, you know, he wasn't on me too much, just, uh, you know, kind of do what you can do, don't play without, you know, play within yourself, don't get tr crazy out there, and uh, it was feeling great, I was, you know, still pissed that, uh, <laughs> you know, got hurt, but that's part of the game, it is what it is, you can't prepare for injuries, but uh, on another note, we kind of, we kind of realized that I, I got to uh, stop overdoing it, I, I kind of overtrained in the summers, and Coming in on days off, I got to kind of take take more day more days off and stop trying to overdo it. How big was it? You've been around for the franchise and actually getting that monkey off your back, making the playoff run. Honestly, uh, it's a uh, it's something that I kind of cherish as far as being being here and being part of something that's building. I mean, it's not like we came in and it's already established and you know you just you're just whatever. But you know, we're really trying to build something here. We're trying to establish. You know, the Bobcats is a you know solid team in the NBA, and I and I love being part of it, and you know want to continue to be part of it. Fans are actually excited about basketball season this year. What are your thoughts on that? With the expectations after making the playoffs, what they got this year? Oh, it's great to have expectations. <laughs> I mean, it's great for the, uh, everywhere I go. The fans, you know, they recognize you and uh, they got good things to say, and they tell you about how they're excited about this season and telling you good luck. So. Uh, I, I'm excited, you know. I'm come from a program, you know, going out, being in Kentucky, where there was always high expectations. So it doesn't bother me with expectations. Tanya, you had a lot of really good nights last year, mm -hmm. uh, nights that I thought you were just outstanding. But can you develop, you think, more consistency this year, where you have uh, more of those nights? Oh yeah, I'm. Uh, I've always felt that I'm a product of uh, how much <laughs> how much time I get. You know, as far as uh, when I'm on the court, I always try to, you know, play well, play hard, and take what's given to me, you know, not being a focal point offensively or defensively, you got to kind of always know how to take what's given to you, and uh, I'm definitely going to try to, you know, do that this year, too. At this point in your career, is there anything you actually work on that's new during the offseason, or just trying to uh -huh. go back and refine everything? I mean, there's nothing new. Uh, you know, I try to pick up, you know, I try to improve, you know, my weaknesses as far as uh, in the offseason. Like I try to concentrate on, you know, really getting out on screens when I'm playing pickup and things like that. But uh, at this point, 13, going to my 13th year, you're not going to reinvent the wheel, and I'm not going to come in as a left-handed three-man. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm a center, and I can knock down open shots, and I'm a solid rebounder and, you know, solid, solid defender. I'm not a shot blocker, and I'm not going to become one overnight. So, I mean, I, I know what I am, and uh, I'm just going to continue to do it and continue to play hard. It 
was uh it was up and down as golf is. Uh, I've had some some great rounds going and some great nines. I had some great nines and then a bad back nine and, and, and who officially won the battle for you this weekend? Oh, I'm always winning that battle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all oh, you can ask him. He knows. This is two years in a row I've won the battle and uh, I'm gonna continue to win it and I'm gonna continue to rub it in his face. <laughs> and uh, you know, just leave it leave it at that. All right.